Hey, you gorgeous warrior goddess. The next phase of warrior goddess training is our advanced boot camp. And it's a three month intensive where you get totally supported to continue your journey to claim your warrior goddess self, to claim your sassiness, your magic, your creativity, your focus, to know what your purpose is. And we start with committing to yourself, aligning with life and purifying your vessel. First three chapters in the book. You're going to get so much more than it's in the book. You're going to get a lot of different tools and support. And that's the main thing why I love doing the advanced work is that we can do the work on our own and it works so much better to be part of a group of women that are also doing their own work. Here's what I found is that women especially need community. We need support. And especially if you're in a situation where you're not getting support for your own transformation, it's vital to have a group that sees you, that supports you, that is encouraging you to go forward. And even if you never meet any of the women in person that are part of Warrior Goddess training, what happens is this amazing bond between the group builds. And that web of our intent, of our energy, helps us all go farther. I've seen it over and over again. I've seen this with myself. Things that I couldn't do, I couldn't get to, I couldn't unwind in myself. When I'm part of a group, suddenly I have the energy. I have the support. I have the guidance. And you can have that too. It's a huge gift to give yourself a circle that builds the energy over time so that you have the energy you need to find the truth of who you are, to undo the old lies, the old ways of being, the old patterns, to step into your true authenticity. The program is three months, October, November, December. And I'm really excited about it being starting in the fall because the fall is time, really the time for us to go inside. And in our society, it's not that way. We're really told to go scatter our energy. And a lot of us really struggle over the holiday season. And so to have a circle of support through the holidays to then start the new year from a place of strength rather than a place of, okay, I'm going to start again. It's really wonderful. We will go through many different practices. So it's not just a theoretical, it is a lot of tool based and they're simple. It's one of the things that my passion is. It's helping women to take action in their lives. And I know that in order to take actions in our life, we need seriously easy, clear tools to do that. And then also tools that we get immediate results and that inspire us. So you'll get specific practices to do. And I want to share a couple of the tools that we work with that help to really rewire our energy and how we are in the world. First one's recapitulation. It's really the most potent tool of the Toltec tradition. Recapitulation is a simple practice that has incredible results. And what it is, is it's going back through our history, through our past, and gathering the energy that we've lost. As we engage in the world, any place that we have connected out of fear, any place that we've had gone against ourselves, not been true to ourselves, we lose energy. And so the practice of recapitulation teaches us how to go back and using our breath and our intent, gather our energy back and bring it into this moment. And the awesome thing is that not only do we clean up the past, then we are also training our bodies to not lose energy in the present and in the future. So as we're going forward, we learn, oh wait, 
I'm losing energy, let me bring it back. We stop putting our attention on other people, fixing other people, well, I lost energy because of them or this difficult situation. Because the truth is you can't change the people outside of you. You can change yourself. And this is a practice that brings the power back to you so that you stop losing energy regardless of what's happening outside, that you stay in your own center. It's so exciting. And the second big tool that we work with is the strategies. So as mentioned in the book, that there are four different strategies that we tend to fall into. Pleaser, controller, isolator, and distractor. So we'll do some beautiful work around naming what our strategy is that doesn't serve us, untangling how it gets triggered in the world, where it comes out, and learning new ways of being without the strategy. And also how to bring the gifts of the strategy into your life, because every strategy has gifts. So we'll bring the gifts in, and we'll let go of what doesn't serve. We'll shed that old skin of how we've been. Every month there's also a focus, which is really helpful. So just like with the boot camp, there was a focus every day. Now you'll have a focus every month, and you'll be held and supported in that focus. Month one, committing to yourself. And you'll get an opportunity to get clear what is my commitment and what is it that I want to create for myself? What is my new dream? And not only does this happen from the intellect, we'll be doing different art projects, yeah, we'll say, that will get you into beyond your thinking and into your body, into your knowing, into your intuition. Because thinking can only get us so far. But the wisdom of your being is really the guide here. We'll be pulling your own wisdom out. The second month, aligning with life. You'll learn how to shift from linear thinking. I have to do this to do this. And what so many of us do, well, when I do this and this and this, then I'll get that. We'll learn how to totally rearrange so that we're in flow with ourselves and with life. And the third month, we'll be focusing, oh, and I didn't, ooh, okay, second month. We also then get a practice that is a practice I developed a long time ago, which is a prayer that works with each of the elements and honoring the different parts of ourself, mind, emotion, energetic, and physical body. And then also using the elements as allies, air, fire, water, and earth. I still do it. It's a daily practice, really simple, that helps us to align with ourselves and with life. Third month, purifying your vessel. So each of us carries baggage, carries the beliefs and thoughts that we learned, and also stuff we pick up from other people. And that's heavy. And so to purify ourselves, it's the willingness to clean our temple, to claim ourselves as a temple, and then to do the work that's necessary to clean. And for me, that work is joyful. So I'm going to teach you how to bring joy into your own clearing, cleaning process, because it doesn't have to be heavy. Even the difficult stuff, it doesn't have to be heavy. We can bring our lightness, our faith, our humor into our cleaning. So we'll go through practices of the cleaning the mind, cleaning the emotions, cleaning the body, cleaning our energetic being. We'll look at our strategies, and we'll also learn how to be in relationship with people in their strategies in a way that we are present and not in struggle with them. So those three months then will give you a new foundation, a foundation that's for you and that will benefit everyone in your life. I hope that you join me in this journey 
where you'll have the opportunity to connect with me live. We do online calls, and there's also an added bonus if you want to travel to Austin or if you're in Austin and want to do live intensives. There are three live intensives that are a bonus for the program. The online portion, everything's recorded. So the gift is if you can't join live, you can do the recording. And for the live classes, I've set two different dates. One's an evening in the United States and one's an afternoon in the United States, which means that if you're in Europe or Asia or Australia or anywhere else in the world, the afternoon class often hits your evening or your early morning. So it works out that it works for many time zones. So you get options. We meet the first and third Wednesdays or and the second and fourth Thursdays. You can do all four if you want. Or if you can't do any of them, you can go back and listen to the recordings. You'll have access to those recordings 24 seven. And I do the video and then I also do audio because I know there's a lot of women that download the audio and listen to it on the way to work or when they're out jogging. You can be really creative in how you connect. Over the years of women that have done this program, which originally was called 13 Moons and is now synthesized down, we're doing three month increments, so they have had huge transformation. And they've told me that they've cleared up health problems, they've changed the relationship with their family, they've had children when they couldn't have children before, they've written their books, they found themselves. I know this program works. I've seen it happen in hundreds of women. I've seen it work in myself. And I invite you to be part of this circle of warrior goddesses to come back home to your sisters, to yourself. If you have any questions at all, please feel free to email me, heatherash at tosi.org. And you take care. I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Doo, 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 doo. Ah, last piece. You can pay monthly or you can pay it all at once. The program is $275 for all three months or $99 if you pay in increments. If you're in Austin or you want to travel to Austin, we meet the third Saturday, October, November, the second Saturday in December. And it's between noon and six o'clock. So if you can join us for that, that's only an additional $100. Crazy, I know. $375 for the intensive that's based in Austin. You still get all the recordings, all the live classes. If you're in Austin, you also get Wednesday night classes. And paying monthly, $133 a month. If you really, really want to do the program but don't have the resources right now, write me and we'll see what we can work out. I would, again, love you to be part of this circle. And I just, I really want for all of us to feel held. And that's my intent with offering Warrior Goddess training and these intensives is that we come back to knowing that we are seen, that we're loved, that we're supported to become the woman that we were meant to be. So step in, commit to you and know that that commitment will help change the world. Blessings.